The Psycho P Show, a.k.a. The World's Worst Name Podcast. So yeah, that's yeah, that's really interesting about the music thing, dude. Your shit's pretty nice. Right. I've been uh, doing it for a couple of years, but like I said, I just stopped for a while because I was just really bored and with it, and I didn't have any inspiration. I wasn't. You wasn't feeling the same. Yeah, I just didn't think my shit was good. Well, I think that's actually a good way to think of your shit. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Toughest critic is my own. No, Crystal can't talk now. Yeah. <laughs> Every time she talks, just block her out. Oh my god. <laughs> we should stop recording if she can't talk. No, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> at first, I was gonna say something, and then my eyes just looked at the phone like, oh my gosh, I forgot it was on. Uh, <laughs> you should just forget about it. Just forget, just forget about, about it. it. Just forget about it. I remember growing up, Richard always used to write a lot of poems. Yeah. He'd always put a lot of poetry with his English teacher and entered in nice. contests and stuff. and. He, he always has a lot of feeling in there, and so I knew then when he started drumming, yeah. drumming to beats, yeah, I would yeah. listen to, I was listening to Aqua Barbie Girl, and he'd be there going, <laughs> yeah, right the there, sticks. doing something right along with me. Uh, right. Right. I knew there, one day, if he could put that all together, he'd kill it. I think he, uh, dude, yeah, I mean, it's so funny, like, <laughs> we were talking about the other dude, that shit is so funny, the other yeah. rapper. Yeah, no. That's so fun. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't. I wanted about. to put a Facebook post and say, uh, "I listened to some music today and lost faith in every type of music, dog." I just because he's still my friend, you know. <laughs> I don't want to put that on there, but I just knew you would just get all by her. Like, if you're an artist <laughs> and you get mad that your friends <coughs> don't buy your art, you're a fucking shithead. Just get better at your fucking art. You yeah. shit bird. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's no easy way to say it. You fuckhead. Yo, you know how many people have been on this show? I've asked them to subscribe and review. The l- end of the launch period is today. Mm-hmm. I had like a little like... It, it, I, I don't even want to get into it. But, um... <laughs> bro, even getting people to review on a show that they're on... Yeah. Completely difficult. Yeah, so I just say yeah, it once yeah. and then I just laugh it up. Like, yeah, that's why you need to throw some contests out and stuff. Like, you know. No, I mean, it's gonna it's gonna work out, bro. Everything like it takes some time, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But um, we'll get like it's camera, just like we'll get a camera and go around with you all day, every day. You know what I mean? Oh, dude, hell yeah! That's what we're sort of trying to do. In Vegas, we can go and take a trip to Vegas. Already on the books. Yeah, I already went once. I already went once on one. Dude, we'll get together. <laughs> we'll say it's a job. I'll be like, hey, baby, I'm hundred percent down. We can all go. I'm telling you, hundred. We can leave the little kids and fend for themselves, right? Oh, I got Zeus. <laughs> no, Zeus is really good at opening shit. And oh yeah, yeah. Zeus, Zeus is a good dog. Yeah, he's pretty smart. <laughs> <laughs> pretty smart guy. <laughs> he might, you know, he like senses me from so far away. He doesn't even park anymore. I don't. I don't park close, but he must have the greatest sense of smell because he never barks. And I come like out of the corner, like like a fucking wraith, like a fucking. I don't know. You, yeah, you remember those ring rays from Lord of the Rings? They come like that, all black, and the heat out here. I think it's just natural. This yeah. guy, Yo, <laughs> he leaves everybody happy. Crystal he just doesn't yeah. hurt nobody. Crystal just saw him fucking headbutt me in the stomach. So what else Dude, was he doing? Was? I'm gonna tell you what. Right now, he got out. Okay, he got out when uh, I believe when the trash was taken out. And uh, we walked outside, and she ran out to the grass and ran out, and she was like, he's over here, and started walking out there, and uh, they're about a good, I want to say a good 150 to 200 feet away, and uh, he just sees me, right, and he starts launching towards me, bro, and you see him, and he's launching and just rams right into my nuts, and I'm just like, okay, let's go inside, and you just, oh my god. You're like 70 pounds. Oh, like. oh, and then I thought, like, as I was watching him run, I didn't even think about that. I thought about what other people thought about when he was running. 
I was like, you look like a beast. Like, everybody would have been scared and running away and being like, oh, my God. Uh, he, a, he looks like a monster. Yeah, here's a man eating a pit bull outside. Yeah. Call the pet people. Or and he is calling yeah. just head with people and just... <laughs> just yeah. played with him yeah. and he would get himself right. shot up That's in so like 10 funny. seconds I know. talking That's about funny. nuts your one year old uh, she grabbed your three year old nuts and everything oh <laughs> he was God. sitting on the couch with his ah. knees up like this yeah. and she was trying to crawl up the couch <laughs> went threw over her leg grabbed ah. his nuts to use his nuts <laughs> Not to cry? Well, kind of, yeah, but for no reason. But that's a logical reason to cry. But <laughs> yeah, because like, your balls are in a baby vice grip. You know how babies grab so tight with their like chi or their, like internal power or some shit, yeah. right? That was a chi grab on some other baby nuts. <laughs> that's just terrible, yeah. man. Yeah. I'm just happy it wasn't, um, you know. <laughs> oh, yeah, it didn't actually yeah, go down sure. like you were there to sort of block it. Yeah. But who knows how many times it actually goes down. That's so hilarious. Oh my god, I wasn't even there. That's so great. I wish I had that on camera. <coughs> Me too, because he was wearing these really thin shorts that clung to him, so I could see the whole package and everything, and I just saw it. I was like, oh no. You were like, oh my god, this That's is bad. That's gonna happen. It was, like yeah. a, it was probably in slow-mo to you. Yeah. Did you have iPhone heights? <laughs> but yeah. I just saw her little hand go. Oh, <laughs> it's not a no. That's so funny. That's hilarious. So I told him, dude, you gotta keep your legs closed. You yeah. know, doing anything like that. But and then he probably said one of his famous yeah, quips. Know. What am I th- yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he just said. Now that's crazy. how you grab steak. <laughs> 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 Now, be careful with that beef on your grill. Okay, okay. That is good. Was that too hot to handle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. you're right. Beef. Yeah, In the good. freezer, yeah. not the fryer. Yeah, no, just go ahead and tell them that story when they're 13 and 16 and see how... In front of their friends. In front of their friends. Yeah. So, so when you were little, time. you grabbed his... Oh, oh. Ready? <laughs> Baby, what are you doing here? <laughs> oh, oh alright, well, this, what's happening here with the little oh, herbs? Oh. oh man. Oh man. That was funny. The kids were right. in. I don't want that in here. <laughs> I should have closed the door. The no, I did. The kids were in. They were just like, what's up, dog? Yeah. Yo, what's up? What you guys doing? I know. <laughs> Man. So, I don't know if that was because of the show, but, you know, the show ruins friendships and uh, makes babies cry. You know? Yeah. Apparently. <laughs> apparently. Awesome. I mean, they're just standing there, like, looking at her, like, uh, you said go play. Like, why are you tripping? <laughs> Let me get that blaster. So, yeah. <laughs> presidential debate talk today. No, is it? Go. Yeah, I guess, man, right now. Oh, dude. Uh, is I that Hillary email. thing? What's up? What's up with that email thing? Is that what you're talking about? Nah, I was like, oh, did Hillary actually win the nomination, or is that just fake? I, 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 I can't oh, I don't know. Let me find out. Hey, Siri, presidential elections update. I gave up on following it yeah. because I decided that they already know who's going to win. They already decided yeah. who's going to win. It's already all in motion and they're just putting on this show yeah. for you. It's Dan Bazarian, the king of Instagram. He's going to come out of left field with it. Use the followers, man. Not nah, yeah. yeah. It's probably gonna be Trump right, or some bullshit. So I don't even know. it's probably, it might be Hillary. I have fucking no idea. It's just a joke. <laughs> it's all a joke. What if what if out of nowhere 
Al Gore wins. <laughs> right? That would be Al Gore's so like, hilarious. Forgot about me, guys. I, I invented the, the internet. Tr- I'm trying to <laughs> save the tree. Yeah, I'm trying to save the trees. I, I have recently the watched the Lorax. The oceans are bigger and deeper than ever. <coughs> and I invented the internet. <coughs> All right, so yeah. I'm Al Gore. Gore. Here we go. Gore. We've got the delegates <laughs> leaderboard. We whatever got. makes me win. <laughs> <laughs> I have three names. <laughs> three names on the ballot. They all count for me. <laughs> all right, so we got. Hillary Clinton, twenty-seven eighty-four, what and that Democratic for? twenty-three eighty-three needed. So okay, have, so she's not done yet. No, no, she's passed five hundred. Oh, she. Yeah, because she's got. They only need two uh, thousand three hundred eighty-three, and she's got two thousand seven hundred. Yo, Crystal. And uh, she just left. She just left. She was so bored with the uh, fucking politics, she was gone. So like, I'm out. I, I can't talk to you. But guys. Donald Trump's got over two. He's got 1,500 when he only needs 1,200. Damn. Bernie Sanders is still back there. He cares too much about the world. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. He cares too much about the world to sell out and actually win. Yeah. Because to win, you know, you got to sell out. This is part of the. This part of the plot nowadays. It's just crazy. Dude. And then it's you like... just get in, and then. And then you fucking be like, gotcha, bitches, you s- sorry sacks of shit, I took mm. your money, and now I'm doing this other shit, you Who, son of a bitch. We That's talk- why everyone hates Obama, because he does whatever the fuck he wants. We talked about this before. You said that you don't vote, correct? Um, or you just don't have an opinion. Yeah, I don't have an opinion right now. I might, I not, I might not vote for the president, to be I, honest. Yeah, I'm not this... this I, I literally think they're both terrible, and I'm like, wow, like, I have to throw a vote one way or another. That's just... Yeah. So one's a criminal and the other one looks like he's about to be like a semi fucking Nazi like figure. I'm just like, this is sort of crazy. I know. I mean, and that's the crazy thing is that if I were, if you really wanted my honest opinion, if I really wanted to get a good vote in, yeah. the only reason why I would choose Bernie Sanders is because when you told, when you asked me, or when we talked about this the last time and you said, uh, you said, um, you put the view in my eyes when what would happen if they lost you know how would they feel and you said Donald Trump probably doesn't care if right. he lost and that's when I was like whoa what the fuck I was like I can't even believe I didn't think about that you know, and that fucking care. dude Bernie Sanders is probably devastated that he's not winning you know what I mean oh, I was like, fuck, I'm getting all these fucking views but these stupid ass delegates that she's had you know before the fucking race you know all that shit's all fucked up you know what I mean it is fucked up. I feel really bad for her. Especially since it's probably his last hurrah. I mean, honestly, yo, I hate to say this, but what if homie just dies? Like, you know how, like, when people feel like they're done with their life, they have no more purpose? Like, yeah. what if he just dies? Like, oh, he's, like, man. old enough to be like, yo, I'm done. Yeah. I'm done. These motherfuckers will never get it. Next election term, I'll be, like, 92 or some shit. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, that sucks, man. But... They're going up in Cleveland in July 18th, Philadelphia the 25th, and the general election is November 8th. It's crazy. And I think Fox is doing it. And then Broadway Russian change. change. Fuck. That's just crazy. Have you seen the uh, Carbonaro effect, though? No, 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 no. Is it good? Yeah, it's amazing. I think. Is that the one where they do like pranks? Sort? Yeah, slash magic. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I've you, seen it a little bit. Yeah, that's it. Some of it. <laughs> you know, like I saw one trick that I was like, man, that shit's so fake. Like just I would, once. I would slap a dude if they came with that. I was like, I would literally probably just like, oh, I'm sorry. Well, it depends. Like, what do you do? But, yeah, it's on the phone. How are you? No, yeah, no, no. It's everywhere. Oh, it's like everywhere. remember that magic trick show I showed you online, where he like, uh, for example, one magic trick is that. uh you go up and you're getting a slushy, all right, or uh, uh, a mixed drink, okay, and it's like vegetable based. And you're going to your shop, and he's mixing everything up, and then he's just like, "Yo, you know," and he pulls out this little bottom container on accident, quote unquote, but he wants you to see it, and it's all black sludge. And she's like, "Oh, what the, what the hell's that?" And he goes, "Oh, that's uh, all the toxins that come out of the the vegetables. You don't you don't want it." You know, drink that, and he, she goes, "Oh, oh, ew, yeah, that's gross, that's crazy." That comes from, all from one. She goes, "Oh no, that's collected. You know, this comes over one or two days or so." And she's like, "Oh, okay." And so 
he pours it out, you know, and he's like showing it to her and he's like, yo, you know, check this out, you know. It's kind of interesting because since, and it starts making a form as he's talking and she's like, what the hell is it doing? And it turns into, he goes, well, it all comes together since it's like plant matter, you can pick it up, you know, and so he picks it up. And then he picks it up and it's like in your face now. And you're like, oh shit. And then he puts it in this napkin and he folds it down. Yeah. And then it turns into an octopus and shit. It's just fucking sick, dude. And you're just like... <laughs> what? Yeah. That's so sick. Yeah. I'll show you on the fucking phone right now. That's so... I got a dip, my man. No, you're good. Oh, man. I'm just going to send you a link or just look it up. Yeah, no. Send me a link. Send me a link. Yeah, that number is just for you. You guys only... Oh, no. I it. forgot. No, I, I've already deleted it. Okay, but... cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I know. But I appreciate it. Man. Okay. All right. What do you guys have planned for the day? Not Ch- being on Chilaxing. a podcast. Uh, no, I just kidding. I've been on that shit all day. Like, I want to get a badass camera. Like, yeah. Because ba- I've thought about that shit, dude. And yeah. I've thought about a lot of great ideas. Yes. Yeah. Maximize the living shit out of that kind of shit. We can do some shit. No, I'm telling you, bro. Like, if we if we looked around and got a badass video camera with the little microphone and shit, we could walk around and shit. We could get the microphones at the Audio Express and hook up to our phones. You know what I mean? And be walking around and like doing shit and do skits and shit. You know what I mean? Yeah, we were already planning on doing some shit like that. You know, but I would like to walk around like because if we had our cards and shit, you know what I mean? Yeah. We could, you know, or talk debates about anything with anybody, you know what I mean? Have yeah. postcards and shit, like, like people do, like, pranks about, you know, leaving money, dropping money. She mentioned, you know, dropping money in front of people and shit together. I don't even know if I want to do pranks but, as much as I want to do skits or some shit. Yeah, I, I mean, yeah. Not, I want to go on some crazy I, shit. I get, yeah. a, I get a high out of seeing what people do and the decisions that they would make. And I was yeah. saying having fake money printed out and see who would... Who would really but people do this, that shit. No, though. but they say, yeah, "Hey, yeah, here, yeah, you yeah. drop some money," or who would take it? Mm-hmm. You know? Yeah. Oh my god! And, but are you yeah. setting people up for failure? No why? I mean, yeah. Just because because we saw one saying. with the wallet, right? But yeah. a lot of people could think, "Oh, what would I?" Most of what's in a wallet, there could be nothing in there. It could be a bunch of this guy's ID. He's like, "Give it back." Well, there's but yeah, a fifty dollar yeah, yeah. bill. There was one where there was this oh, blind boy. guy, he was pretending to be blind, and he was like, hey, you know, I got this lottery ticket here, you know, someone helped me out with it and said it's a winner, and he's like, I to verify it. And then they're like, oh, really? And then he's like, yeah, you know. And so he's, oh yeah, it's a $500 winner. And he's just like, oh wow. You know, but nobody says it except for one person, or the homeless people that he asked. He yeah. Asked everybody else was like, took that shit. And the first person, he was like, yeah, I just want to check if it was a winner. And he was like, all right. And he looked at it and he was like, bounce. And just turned around and walked away. Damn. That's what I'm saying. Like, people, like, they, you override their morality when it comes to survival like that. Because most of them don't have money to fucking, yeah. like, they spend money as soon as it hits their hands, so... No, don't worry. I don't like, they're just, like, already in the negative. Like, oh, my God, this 500 is going to pull me out right now. One time I was walking. One time I was walking by Apache and Rule by the Taco Bell, and I looked at the ground and I saw a hundred dollars. And then I went lower to the ground, another hundred. I was like, "What the fuck?" Huh? What really? Yeah. Oh no! It was a. Oh, it was just one hundred. I went lower to see if there's anything else. Nothing. Oh. Okay. I walked past and. uh... The car that I was looking under, like, the little beeper went off. I was like, oh, great. Someone thought I was, like, stealing their shit or whatever. And this fucking huge black dude comes out. And he's like, yo, what's up, man? I was like, what's up? And he's like, what were you doing by my car, man? And I just looked at him. I was like, yo, low key, um, found some money on the ground. And he just looked at me. And then he went into his pocket and he grabbed some money and he started pulling it out and I could see if he had like 180 on him. And he looked at me and he's like, yo man, you're not gonna believe this, but uh, that's my car and like, I, that's my 100, like I dropped that 100 and he's wearing basketball shorts. And I looked at him and I was like, really starved for cash. But yeah. I looked at him and I was just like, 
you know what, bro? Here you go. And I gave it back to him. And he mm. gave me a big hug, the stranger. He's yeah. like, man, you saved, you saved my day, man. Thank you so much. And I knew he was going to go get weed with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because like, the amount, like, he was going to go get an ounce, I could tell, like, he probably owed it to someone or some shit. Yeah. Was but, it a tall yeah. black guy? <laughs> yeah, it was a tall black guy. No, I only plays play basketball. basketball. I told him this. I was like, yo, there's no reason I should believe you. Yeah, I told him. I was like, there's no reason I should believe you. But... What kind of car was it, you said? Um, it was like a black band. I was just wondering. It's like, there's no reason, um, I should believe you. But I do. So here you go. I had more, more than that, more than that cast on me, but I was just like... This fool's probably honestly hurting for it no matter what he's driving, because people don't usually own what they drive. So they're driving around mama's shit or some shit, you know, payment sign that they're breaking their back for, so. I got a disc you guys. Yeah. It was nice to talk yeah, to you. Yeah. All right, Next time we'll have uh, videos and shit. I'll put my iPhone, I have the snap attachment, I'll put it up here in the corner. I want to make a video and shit of our shit. And if you do, then send me, um, send me the video, because I'm already putting it together, and I'll send you a link to the show so you can start listening, so you can see yeah. Because we have video for right some of them. I don't have your number, but you have this one. Just send it to me so I can add it, because that's going to be so fucking cool. We're going to be all... Like, no, like... It's like <laughs> what was that noise? It's like, well, Bang. my favorite... All right, like, what I really want to do, like, in the future, is I want to create commercials. I want to, like, make movies and shit. Like, yeah. that's my ideal... Yeah, I'm trying to do whatever. So I'm trying to go in. getting into that industry is generally what I enjoy doing. That's why I started looking at advertising and stuff and this per- this person I got an interview for tomorrow yeah he advertised for like all the media for like uh, um, Phoenix Suns yeah and like all their things so like all the commercials you see on there for Phoenix Suns yeah comes from this company all right so I gotta go all dressed nicely and shit dressed to kill not stoned status hell yeah I kill it man cause that'd be sick if I get that one to but Cause it's media That's what I want to do Alright well good luck And we'll keep doing some shit And um I'm gonna stop this shit for right now You got some window washing? Uh no Why well, I need a window washing fluid yeah, When your my, alternator doesn't no, work Alright yo my <laughs> My eyes are like super fucked up right now Hold on no. Oh my god, <laughs> hold on, I can't even like right now. <laughs> You're disgusting. No, 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 no. It's, not, it's, it's not, not even that, bro. Because, like, 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 dude, I try to concentrate on what's in front of me, but my vision keeps concentrating on here, on these things. No, yeah, it's really dusty today. I'm not even gonna lie. Yeah. But, uh. Um, but I had, uh, yeah, it got no, this way why yesterday. Don't you tell me this, homie. Huh. What's been happening to you the past 48 hours? You've been chilling with the lady? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. someone's been creeping on your Snapchat. Yeah, I could definitely tell he's sick. Absolutely. Uh, I have no shame I was, there. Yeah, but I was teaching her how to use the Snapchat. Oh, my God. That's the truth. Really? That's that's what you're going to hit me with? No, no, no. I mean, you know, we're chilling. <laughs> he goes, I was teaching, how about the bottles y'all were drinking, huh? Dude, oh, they were the drinking cl- disgusting <laughs> plastic clear, parties. Clear bottle swag. <laughs> <laughs> Dude. I was like, oh, me Yeah, shit. That, that was, um... Okay, okay. And I, I'm only saying this because of the show, and hopefully she never listens to it again, but yeah. that was that one divorce that chick. We, nice. We You're, sort of hooked up, nice. but we didn't, we didn't fuck. We hooked up, but we didn't fuck. Nice, dude. Yeah, Yo, it's all, uh, it's all... But I don't think it's gonna happen. It only, we only hook up if, if it's fucking alcohol flowing, but then she doesn't feel bad, but then she doesn't want to hook up anymore. So it's like, alright. True. It's okay, just like, um, uh, question for you. Do you remember where I said, well, the address I said... No, 100%, you didn't, I don't even know anything about an address. You didn't send me another address. No, I know. You said Michaelis is custom. Oh, I do. There you go. Okay, but what do I, what, what's that do? That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Well, That's it. Just go there. <laughs> I'm going to call her one more there. <laughs> yes, I'm going to leave you back in the oh, I got my car back. Oh. Yeah, I know. It's the same dude, exact car. I'm so pissed, dude. What happened? $75 administration fee plus $20 a day and $455 towing fee. Bro, I literally just gave these scumbags like 900 bucks of my money. Huh. 
Probably on sick. top of the sixteen hundred that I had to give to Honda, dude. I fucking go in there. This woman has like a Rottweiler and another dog, like guarding all the cars that they fucking took from oh people. My right? God. The place is locked. You can't even look in there. That it's like a. They put some kind of like a special uh, screen on. Not a screen. It's like a tents. Yeah. But like you can't see through it, no matter how hard you try. <laughs> so I'm standing there like, what the fuck is going on? And I'm standing there for like 30 seconds, and this woman like comes out. She's like, okay, hold on, I'm gonna put the dogs away. Oh, Bro, she like, go. She's like, dude. Bro, she said that like people come there flipping out. She says like you don't even know what I have to deal with sometimes. And she goes like I don't even want to even like tell you because it's just crazy. Bro, like you can tell, bro, the gate has been rammed mad times. <laughs> it's like oh, <laughs> <laughs> yo, <laughs> literally, bro, just rammed. Yo, fucking, bro. Like, I just, oh. I just realized some shit. What? When I was younger and I saw people in nice cars, I always wondered how they got them. I was like, they must be rich. I didn't understand the credit system and they just got loans and they didn't own the cars, right? Yeah. But then I thought that they were all aware of the fact that they don't own the cars. But now I'm starting to realize that if people are ramming this shit at repo yards, trying to get the cars and shit. <laughs> literally, bro. They they literally, the cars are in there because they don't own them. Mm-hmm. But yet they are feeling a certain type of way about it because emotionally they do own them. <laughs> so yeah. even they're not aware that they don't own the car. Dude. That's what I just realized. You should see how the gate looks like. <laughs> it looks like a mangled Dude, piece of aluminum I, foil. I don't even know how many times. I, gu- <laughs> I, I guarantee you somebody has definitely thrown over like... Malta rat, No, like a rat poison in bologna for the dogs to poison the dogs or something. Dude. I have no doubt, dude. Because the dogs are like chilling in the yard, bro. Like a Rottweiler. Barking. Right, right. I'm like, dude, like all it takes is like a little rat poison and bologna and that's it. No more dogs. That's it. No more dogs. I mean, dogs. I would never do that. I welcome mean, back. Welcome back, Honda. <laughs> Bro, she was like, like she was like, hold, hold on, I'm going to get the dogs out of the way. <laughs> like, all right. You make it sound sort of uh, cute, or is that just your... No, your no, no dude, she general? wasn't cute. She was like, she, an old she wasn't a big, but, you know. An old Denolf. Denilf. 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 Mother never. Yo, what time do you want to stop by tomorrow? For make what, the, the calls? calls? Yeah. Um, you're going to have to scoop me. Because okay. I'm going to drop my car off. Because okay. when, when I start my car, you're going to see. It's like... It takes like five delayed. seconds. Yeah, after this, like, I'm going to chill with you. And then go see uh, Chides. And maybe record with him for a real quick second. Oh, yeah. Hell yes. Real quick. And then, Please do. And then head back in the area. Man, it's already 7.30. Like, what? I know. Why is it? Why do the days go by so fast? The days go by, um, because it's summertime. No, the days are longer in the summer. No. Yeah, we're right, always there. Longer, but psychologically, they're shorter. Why? I don't know, because, uh, actually. Because it's hot and you're, like, I mean, hiding? Yeah, I guess. Actually, I'm in, in Jersey, okay? I'm probably thinking that's more, like, where it's a cold climate, you know? Because yeah. Because when it's cold, it goes by so slow, dude. You ever, like, when was the last time you, like, lived in a place that was, like, really cold during the wintertime? Exactly. Yeah. So, it's like... I guess it does seem to go by slow. I think it really just depends on how much you're doing. Yeah. Yeah, you know we're almost there, right? Yeah. All right, should I stop this? Yeah, for sure. Oh, yeah, for sure. I can finish. Days go by and I'm still, I think of you. What the hell? Destiny to catch. Wow. You like what, that? What Who quote. cares about what the sick quote. game of Destiny? What a quote from VJ. Destiny is a girl I'm dating. <laughs> Wait, Destiny is what? Destiny is a girl I'm dating. No way. No, I'm just fucking no, I was about to say. I like that. Really? You wish. I'm not dating. Dude, every time I hook up with a chick or. Dude, okay, so there's like. Two chicks that want to fuck, and as soon as I got them to the position that they want to fuck through text, I just didn't want to fuck them anymore. Well, you gotta stop jerking off, dude. What? So you gotta. Stop no, they're mastering. they're no they're they're just they're just not that hot, dude. Well, you feel what I'm saying? Yeah. 
<laughs> of course. Okay. Bro, and one, I, of, one, one of them's okay. When's the last time you went right. fishing, my friend? What do you mean? What do you mean? I mean fishing. Yeah, plenty of fishing. Oh shit! I I messaged someone the other day. I'm terrible at it, dude. Oh god, here we go. Because I hate you, bro. Oh I knew that this was gonna happen. I told you this was this was gonna. Yeah, happen. I know. I'm gonna give you all my shit. Please, give me all your shit, bro. By <laughs> Saturday, you're gonna you're gonna have like three dates. But dude, do I even want to when I'm dealing with all this other shit? Sure. You you're gonna want to have a pen pal. But I'm. Oh, <laughs> I love you. I'm just kidding. Fuck, sick. man. I'm sorry. I saw the opening. I know. That was good. That was good. <laughs> Dug it in there. Dug it in there. Nice. Twisted the knife. You son of a bitch. <laughs> Hopefully, it's nothing, you sick I'm um, checking, my friend. I oh, can. I did find out that uh, on SoundCloud, I can upload the tracks, and so all you have to do is make one click. Really? On the days it's oh, ready. sick. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to see that if... And on, I know on YouTube I could do the same thing. So I'll have everything uploaded before if anything if anything happens. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And then... Um, yeah, dude. It's just going to be popping. We're just going to keep it fucking going. The other... Um, my homie Richard, who was on the show uh-huh. today, was excited to be on it. Um, yeah, you know, he was like... He just pumped in general. He's pretty cool, dude. I don't know him for too long, but he's pretty cool. All this, uh, all him and his people. Oh, are bikini really beans, legit. bikini beans. Oh, there they are. Terrible oh coffee. yeah, terrible so coffee. Her, Super hot him, him and his sister, Crystal, were on it. So you know, sort of cool. For, uh, how long? So I was good to you. Uh, we just did like 22 quick minutes. I sort of in a rush. I had to run to that business meeting. Uh huh. Uh, where? Are your fucking boys back? What? Are your boys back? Which one? Oh. <laughs> yeah, they're back, bro. <laughs> the ones that you can't <laughs> can't talk the about. The ones that I fucking the hate nest, that I've never met. The but nest I of fucking, destruction. Oh, my God, dude. Oh, my God. You rightfully hate them, too. One day, my friend. Well, one day. One day. One day, day I, everything's going to be bad for them. I guarantee you. Uh, in some sense, isn't it already? Yeah, in some sense, they're already living in hell, you know? They just don't know Their it. life is hell, yeah, they just don't know it. Yeah, I mean, how can you live in a pigsty? Mm, bro, it's like a that. psychological disease. They, they, they just need, overcome it? They or? need medication. No, it's like a chemical imbalance in their fucking head. And uh, they need medication. All right, listen. This is coming from Mr. OCD. Mr. OCD, yeah. yeah. I never said I don't need medication. Oh, shit. <laughs> but I'm not psychotic. I don't do any damage other than damage to myself. I don't damage other people by the shit I do. Okay, I, good call. You know? Respect, respect. Yeah, but these guys, you know what I mean? <laughs> Who am I hurting? Just myself. <laughs> yeah, these guys have <laughs> fucking... Oh, like go, don't even say it. Live dude, with people and shit. Bro. I know. It sucks that we can't talk about well, this in more depth. Uh, I don't even want to talk about it. Let's talk about how beautiful the view on the right is. But seriously, how nice is that on the right? That's really nice. I know. Isn't it nice? I the fakest lo- view. I love it. Look, look, beautiful glass buildings over a man-made puddle. This is man-made, huh? Where does this water come from again? Um, this is a fucking shit bird. I don't know. They just fucking throw that shit. That's cool, though. What's this? I mean, remember... Does it smell early? good down there, or does it smell, like, nasty as... Nah, it smells like dick, dude. They just threw, like... Really? 1.2 million, like, koi fish in there so that they could kill the mosquitoes. And the fucking bug larva that, get, that just fucking comes up from there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, for oh. sure. Oh, dude, and they're making the stadium all nice. I can't wait. Dude, I can't how wait. long are you gonna live out here? Maybe for the very least three more years. I like it out here, dude. No, I mean I'll have a spot out here, but well, I mean it's new to you, man. I've been out here for a while. I mean I'll st- I'll be c- keep coming in and yeah, out. Yeah, I want to have a house here and like keep coming back. You know? I mean during the winter time, I don't think there's a better place to be. I mean weed goes legal and all that shit. And no, weed, dude. Yeah. In November, I mean yeah, in winter I don't think there's a better place dude, to be. Pod, right? If pot goes legal, bro, the, the I feel like. I feel like the real huge. estate prices are going to jump up. They're going yeah. to. For sure. That means that you... Dude, 
We need to get on our shit. Yeah. Yo, tomorrow. What time you want me to come pick you up? I'm gonna I'm hit you up at like 8.39. Okay. So that you know that I'm gonna drop my car off. Okay. And then pick me up. We'll make that call. Because we need to get our asses in the fucking game, bro. Yo, we could, build up, we could build up money enough that we could buy our own contracts and different yeah. shit later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If we want. Because we need to do the work now so that we can figure out the game, how we need to attack it and just fucking mm-hmm. just start. I agree. Just start. And tell these other mother... Just start put, stacking that cake and so telling these other motherfuckers, what? You need a ride? Yeah, I don't care if it's going to make me $15. I'm out that shit, you fuck. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's nice. Oh, hello. The Indian chick? Yo. She's sort of chunky. Yo. She's a little chunky. But yo, my buddy just got engaged to a horrible, really though. pretty Indian girl in New Jersey, dude. Yeah. My bu- Yo, like a really pretty one. Well, Shit, what, race, what race is your homie? Indian. Oh. Indian guy. Well, that's not high. His name's like Milop or something. Mm. Congratulations, homie. Well, he's not my friend, but like, oh, somebody that, like, co- like, uh, I guess he's like, you're spinning, you're spinning yeah, tails, man. Yeah, not friend. I, I wouldn't even call him a friend, but like, I guess high school buddy. Fuck that nigga. I'm Jamaican. Super fault, man. Where did these Indian guys know where the Indian chicks are at? Shit. Their families, though, man. They say dog. Where, where are the Indian girls at, Veach? Bro, I'm disconnected from that culture, I man. I hate it, man. I know, bro. How do you? How do you? Dip your toes back in. <laughs> you gotta understand, you know, like, like, like the racism is super extreme with Indians. Yeah. We have a caste system that was made by Assyrians so they no longer get enslaved, I think. Mm-hmm. But they made this caste system which favors light skin and being in certain positions and it just made it a system so that oh. these people couldn't be subjugated. Oh. Um... So, so do you get looked down upon well, by these Indian folks? I'm above the caste system in India mm-hmm. because I'm American, which overwrites all of that shit. Mm-hmm. But still, people in the back of their minds would judge me on my caste, which is like a lower caste. Our caste is like all caste names have like a dual a dual meaning. Like a literal and a figurative mm-hmm. meaning. Mm-hmm. So our fi- our literal meaning is the robbers or the bandits, you know. And then our figurative meaning is those that rob your hearts, like those that charm everyone, mm-hmm. whether it's to the positive so or negative. Would you be down to go back to India for a little bit? Yeah, but not probably probably not where I'm from. No, I do. I don't want to live in like little shacks in the middle of. The no, yeah, I'd, I'd rather go to the nice spots yeah. and check it out and do that. Like, what's the nicest spot there? Uh, what, oh, there's what's plenty of nice spots. What's the best spot in India to go to? I would probably, honestly, I'd hit my homie up and I'd be, I'd be like, um, hit my homie Dave up, mm. and his fam is like super well connected and rich over there, which is a huge plus and. They have like military connections in Punjab and they're Sikhs. Yo, let's do it. So they like. Oh my god, that's that's where we're gonna find. That's where we're gonna find our girls. What? I don't even know if you're gonna find. I don't even know if they would even allow it. They would. Well, why not? Not because especially there, they're the strictest of strict. But I'm American, man. I'm Russian. They love Russian people. Nah, but not for marriage. Oh, because they want pure blood Indian children. Uh, sort of. They just want. They want. Bro, they should beg they me want... to fucking marry their daughter. It shouldn't be, the, you know what I mean? I mean, should they? Hell yeah. That doesn't sound like it. What do you mean? <laughs> I would be, just, I would be the, the best husband them. ever. You're the one that wants to marry them. They don't yeah, marry I do. You. Of course they want to marry me. Indian girls love me. Indian girls here. Yo, Indian that girls helicopter in India. just took a while. Oh, look at that yeah. turn. You saw that? Yeah. Indian girls in India, they do some other shit, man. Like what? It's their family that making decisions for them. It's all money, like, your family's not gonna pay no dowry. Fuck no. Yeah, so you're out the system, bro. No, I'm not out the system. You're out I just the gotta system, talk bro. to the dad. Just let no. me have a conversation with You're him. gonna have to talk to the dad and you have to pay him. How much I have to pay him? Mm-hmm. 
Give or take, how much do you think? Depends on the contract, the girl, the family. Contract? Well, it's a verbal contract, but dude, people die for these things. You don't understand. Once the, once the girl's married off, she's not part of that family anymore, technically. The family she comes from. The other family can say whatever they want, do whatever mm-hmm. they want. I mean, the other family can step up and traditionally you can park in front of this house. Wait, what? You can park right here. Yeah, yeah right. No, you, you can't park in here. You can, Why? Because these are for residents, I think. No, they're not. This is, are they? I, I mean, I can't read what that sign says, but I think so. No, this is restricted parking. But, yeah. For residents only. Yeah, Joe, there's a bus guess. right here. All right, all right, hold on, hold on. I mean, damn, that's sort of what, like 10 grand I would have to pay the fan? Dude, it might be more than that. 20? Dude, I can't tell you. That's ridiculous. It depends on the family, dude. It could be way more. That's what I'm like, dude, you don't understand, like, it's not... That's why I was like, oh yeah, it's easy for an Indian dude to get married to an Indian person. I'm serious. It's easy, because there's system set up for that shit. To get married. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I'm not trying to be a dickhead. It's like a bribe, pretty much. Pretty much, dude. I mean, yo, how's my parking? Let me see. Can you see if I got room back there? Hey, yo, just uh, turn your tires. Yeah, 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 that way, that way, that way, go, go. Move forward? Come on, man. But yeah, dude, dowry is a real thing. It's uh, like what the hottest girl is, but the more expensive it is. I, I think dowry exists in America too, dog. Between Indian families, the goal like that. Between first generation, for sure. It's something. Bro, this homie is on the lookout right now. I don't know, they're probably looking for nogs. And they saw us. Yo, dog, are we, uh, are we good? <laughs> well, that's that's how we get the video recorded for these <laughs> ones now. We just hit the helicopter. <laughs> Heli connect. <laughs> hit him with it, baby. Hit him with it. Yeah, we should record soon, maybe. Yeah. Yo, so I was I was reading that. Well, obviously we have to record a bunch just to make sure we have extras and stuff, even though we have plenty extra. Mm-hmm. But probably got to do more focus now that we're after the launch period. Mm-hmm. I got to put up one today, but. Mm-hmm. But probably got to put more focus into the uh, quote unquote marketing and promotion of it. Mm-hmm. So. I, I like the way you did the beat on the, one you, the last one you put up. Yeah? Yeah, because like we're talking kind of through the beat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I love it. You like it? I love it. Yeah, yeah. I'm fucking with it a little bit. I made it like a little bit shorter so people don't have to like listen to the whole right. thing, you know? Yeah, yeah. You know, man, I'm thinking, man. I'm thinking, man. Bam! <laughs> Bam! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna stop this. Sugar. It's back. Oh shit, this tree got me in the face almost. You see that stop? I look like Iverson right there, baby. Yo.